Hi guys, um, it's been a few days since the last video um, and that was mainly because uh, the church hit me really hard and they hurt me. Uh, more proof of their fair game policies still in force. On Wednesday last week I had an article in the local paper, um, the Plymouth Herald, uh, about my medicinal cannabis stance. Uh, a reporter phoned me up earlier on in the week and asked me what my views were about the reclassification. So I get an article printed in the paper. Uh, it's kind of slightly misquoted and they also missed out a lot of facts, but I blame the editor more than the reporter. Um, uh, the headline was, um, they'll have to arrest me. Anyway, uh, the article went online onto the This Is Herald, um, sorry, This Is Plymouth website. And the comments section got attacked by Scientologists. There was about 106 comments on there by the time they took the comments off. Uh, all of them kind of derogatory, really attacking me, and also they knew a lot of personal information about me, and knowing how uh, the CCHR, uh, which is a side front group of Scientology, how they attack um, news reports about psychiatry and um, any anti-Scientology reports, you know, so I wasn't aware that it was um, Scientology. I actually thought it was the general public um, going against me. And I let my emotions let go. I got stressed about the issue and it kicked in a huge relapse. Uh, it's quite agonizing and it still is. I'm getting paralysis in my right hand, uh, my right arm, my legs are collapsing and it hurts like buggery. So Scientology really hurt me. I'd like to remind Scientology and the Plymouth Org about why I've been protesting the way that I have. Back in March, myself and Kaz, another Plymouth protester, uh, we went down to give leaflets to people who have just finished taking the stress test. And it was all very passive. I wasn't feeling very well that day. I didn't have the scooter. I had this, just the walking stick. And four Scientologists came down with the sole intention to bait us. Anyway, they pushed me around. And... Shut up, mate. You're quite fucked up, Look at you. I think if we just turn it round, see? Yeah. Yeah. Um, excuse me. You can't have salt. Like oh, you can do. But, yeah. um, you can't grab hold of it like that. Yeah. That, that could be classed as assault. Really? I need physical contact. So, do you want to actually charge me for assault then? Um, no, but it's going to be on YouTube in a uh, by this evening. So. Giving me absolutely everything. Thank you. Right. Well, that's good for you. Unfortunately, it's actually caused some people to. Uh, uh, well, then stop standing in front of me, then. I wasn't very steady on my feet at the best of times. I, 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 I never am. And they were pushing me, they were also attacking the medicinal cannabis stance, basically trying to divert any questions again, uh, about Scientology to them. And I was a fairly uh, naive protester back then. It was my first experience of fair gaming. And so I thought, sod it, I got my mobile phone out and started recording them. All of them tried to nudge into me and try and push me and just generally acting quite nastily. And it's not their fault, they were just... Um, responding according to Hubbard Tech. Anyway, they wound me up that day back in March, which meant that when I got my mobility scooter, I was able to attack them in sort of quite a direct manner. After Wednesday, it got really personal, and I'd like the church to know that it got really personal. You really hurt me, and you attacked a cause that is very, very close to my heart. So, You've raised the stakes, so will I. I've got some very, very interesting plans uh, in the pipeline. I don't want to say too much on YouTube. You'll see them as they happen and as the films are edited. But your days are numbered in Plymouth. <laughs> uh, I'm going to drive you out of town. We are going to drive you out of town. We've got a good, strong force behind us. We've got public support growing by the day. Plymouth Org is on a total down stat. They're not selling the coppers of Dianetics. Um, their name is Dirt and Plymouth, and their time is numbered, their days are numbered. So, if you've been impressed with what you've seen on YouTube so far, you ain't seen nothing yet. Watch this space for more, and uh, keep up the good work elsewhere. Uh, when I'm relapsing and when I'm hurting in bed, it's 
really great reading up about the winds that are happening elsewhere in the world, so keep them up. Take care. See you soon.